Hey everyone, I wanted to jump on here and share some breaking news. Neuralink has implanted in their first human trial participant in the United Kingdom. Earlier today on X, they announced this. They said, We're excited to announce our first participant in the UK. Paul, who is paralyzed due to motor neuron disease, received his Neuralink implant at UCLH earlier this month and was able to control a computer with his thoughts just after surgery. And the University of College London Hospitals is UCLH. Um, this is a picture of Paul. And then Neuralink followed it up with this post showcasing Paul playing this video game just with his mind. Um, and then this marks an important step toward making our technology available to help people around the world. And that's true as the head of mechanical engineering for the surgery team um, Ashra Danish says, this is just the start. They've implanted in patients in the United States, Canada, and UK, and soon they'll be implanting in patients in the UAE. And as you guys can see, the comments here are very positive. I believe this is Neuralink's first patient who is paralyzed due to motor neuron disease. Uh, the prior patients were paralyzed due to a spinal cord injury or ALS. This patient brings them to a total of at least 13 patients implanted. I personally suspect that there are more than that, um, but we're up to at least 13 now. And if you're interested in applying to be part of the patient registry, go to Neuralink's website and sign up at their clinical trials page right here. To stay informed and up to date about all things related to Neuralink, make sure to subscribe, especially because I'm about to share an interview where I talked with Neuralink's eighth patient, Nick Ray. We had a great conversation and he shared a lot about his daily life using the Neuralink device. Thanks and hope to catch you next time.